Hey, we're back for another High Tide Imbibe beer review. And this time we're going to be looking at Lies Table Beer from Two Crows Brewing out of Halifax, Nova Scotia. Two Crows have been around for a little while now. they got some interesting styles. They seem to gravitate towards more Belgian type stuff, or at least Belgian adjacent. And this is no different here. Although uh, Table Beer really isn't so much a style as it is a catch-all for a lot of low alcohol beers. There's different origins for the table beer uh, that are laid claim by uh, different countries. Best not, you know, sort of dwell into that too much. It, it basically just means low alcohol beers, beers that um, are usually about 3% or under. Uh, Saison's kind of fall into this as well although saisons were sort of used for a different thing this is more beers that you have with food that are low alcohol sometimes they were brewed that way for tax reasons sometimes they're brewed that way so you can just you know have some beers with the family even have the kids involved uh, especially from european traditions and not get them all hammered so there you go whereas uh, saisons were generally brewed as a substitute for water for uh, farmers and the such working in fields because you couldn't trust water back then they didn't have any way of really purifying it so there you go so this one sits at 3.5 percent alcohol by volume 13 ibus and they do have an ingredients list on this barley oats hops water yeast this beer, like I said, a catch-all for styles, it can basically, like a Saison, have anything. It can be anything. It's basically just sort of a, any kind of beer, any kind of ingredients, as long as it sort of fits under the uh, very low alcohol style. So there you go. Take the aroma here. Mmm. Very nice. It's very kind of perfumey. Um, you get a lot of a little bit of estery hints here. It's a sweet, slight banana kind of note there. Um, very uh, wit beerish. And yeah, it's got a little bit of a spicy kick to it on the nose. Uh, very, very pleasant, very nice. So we'll go right to the taste. Cheers. Oh yeah. Mm. So this comes off very much like a uh, very light alcohol wit beer. Um, it's, again, it's got sort of that estery, banana-y kind of taste in it in the background. Uh, kind of a lemon sourish, sour kind of um, kick to it. Uh, and it's got a bit of a very spicy, dry kind of backbone. Um, very um, almost mild coriander kind of uh, spicy backbone there. It's very refreshing. Very much makes you want to take another sip. <clears throat> very, very good. Do not know what kind of yeast they employ in this. So I'm not sure if I'm getting uh, the sort of estuary uh, vibe from the yeast or if it's just something else from the beer. Bodies, upper light bodied. Mm. This is one of my favorites, uh, especially for hot days. Uh, it's very much geared towards that. Um, it's a good beer to have if you just want to do a little bit of day drinking and you don't want to get too drunk. Uh, if you just want to sit back and enjoy yourself and uh, get a little buzz on over a few hours, a couple of these, like six of these or so would be fine. Mm. But very, very tasty. So like I said, very much a catch-all as far as style goes. And so giving a sort of a style grade seems a little bit uh, of a dumb thing to do, but that being said, having had a lot of sort of saisons and low alcohol beers of this sort of type, if any of those beers can kind of fall into this sort of style, I'd go this 
probably a solid nine. It could be a little bit lighter, maybe. A little bit lighter. But otherwise, pretty much spot on for this type of beer or what it's supposed to be. And as far as personal preferences go, I'm also going to throw a nine on this. I think it's fucking lovely. It's just a beautiful, simple little beer that's put together. Um, definitely a great alternative to a lot of wit beers out there. Uh, it's a bit drier. And uh, it just goes down really good. It goes down really, really good. Very refreshing. So there you go. Nine and nine for this one. The Lies from Two Crows, their table beer. And... We will see you guys again. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.